and good evening. Hello, hello. Let's see, Antonio, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you, my friend? Ready for the class? Yes, I'm ready, teacher. Excellent, excellent. That's great, that's great. Tell me, how was your weekend? Did you have a good weekend? Mm, yes. Uh, only yesterday, but I I get at home. Oh, I was at home. Yes, I was at home. I I, I was tired. I imagine a long week at work. Yes. Okay, but the good thing is that you're here, my friend, and ready for the class, right? Yes. And what about today? How was your day? A hard day at work? Mondays for me are hard, are terrible. Yes. And also today too, uh, hard, hard work. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, for yeah. me, Mondays are difficult. I'm sorry, teacher. Yeah. Well, Antonio, welcome. Thank you, teacher. Oscar. Hello, Oscar. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Fine. Okay. Good evening. Lovely night. And tell me, how was your weekend? Um, uh, yesterday, um, Sleeping, sleeping. Oh, rest. really? Only day you rest. That's nice. Well, yeah, but okay. uh, today, Monday, uh, work. Yeah, back to work, right? Yeah. Again, to work. Yeah, that's the life. That's the life. What can we do? I mean, it's, it's part of the... It's part of the everyday activities, you know? There's no option. Oscar, welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Thanks to you for being here. Let's see. Hmm. Who else is around? Karen. Hello, Karen. Hello, teacher. How are you? Um, fine. How was your day? It was a very busy day. Really? Yes, I had a lot of work. Oh my gosh. And what about the weekend? I was... I was working. And Sunday? Yes, I had to finish uh, a report. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, you told me the other day, right? Yes. Yeah, I remember you telling me. Yes. Well, but... But the good thing is that, I mean, I imagine you finished your report. Yes, I did. Yeah, because, I mean, if you made a big effort, hopefully you finish it. Yeah, I understand you. You know, yesterday I finished, uh, I had a homework from the university. I finished it at 11 p.m. Wow. Yeah, so, I mean, what can we do? Yes. I mean, it's part of everyday activities, so as I was saying, I mean, there's no way out of it. Yes. But we need to face every day with a good face. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I mean, it's another day, another dollar. Yes, that's true. Yeah, I mean, 
As I told you, another day, another dollar. We got to do what we got to do. Yeah. Hey, Karen. Welcome to the class. Thanks nice having you here. Thank you, teacher. Magdaleno, good evening. I'm not going to ask you how was your weekend because I know that the weekend is your is the, the, the time that you work a lot. Hello, Magdaleno. How are you? Uh, I am expecting the class, teacher. That's great. That's great. And tell me, how's everything? How was today for you? My day. My day was busy, but I am in, I am at home and uh, so, since a few minutes I was making dinner. Making oh, really? Dinner you food. cook? Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> Ex boil. <laughs> oh, what's your specialty in the kitchen? Is is coffee and eggs fried, fried, fried eggs, fried eggs. Yes. Okay. Okay. Fried, fried eggs. How? Scramble, sunny fried up. Is my, over? My special is scrambles. Scramble eggs. with with onions and tomato. Uh -huh. Okay. Do you like them sunny side up? Uh, what I like? Do you like them? Do you like eggs sunny side up? Sunny side up. I don't know what is that. When you throw them sunny and they up. fry and they got the little yellow thing in the middle, that's sunny side up. Wow. <laughs> How is it? I like it. I like it, but I don't I I I did I didn't know the phrase, the name oh. of this act. Yeah, sunny side up. You know, a sunny friend of mine that yeah, a friend of mine who worked in the in a kitchen told me that phrase he told me no that's sunny side up and i was like wow <laughs> and it makes sense because it's the yellow part goes up in my in my mind is the el sol el sol del lado de arriba facing up <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah it's funny it's funny the first, the first the first thing in my mind in spanish in spanish was ah, looking up to the sun no, nothing at all. Yes, yes. it's so funny. No, it is. You know, some phrases in English are. Yeah. Yes, it's a new phrase. Thank you. It's great. Well, you know, in my case, I cannot cook. I don't cook at all. And really? And, yeah, when you're, and when your wife is not in home, is not at home? I don't eat. Ah, really? Yeah, or I go buy something. <laughs> no, my. <laughs> I go to the gas station. I mean, a hot dog, a little hamburger. That's really? it. Well, yeah, if my son is home, he cooks. He can cook. Ah. But well. me, I never, I never learned. And to be honest with you, up to this time in my life, I don't want to learn. <laughs> Actually, you, you don't like cook. Man, I, I was never attracted to it and, and I never learned. And that's funny because in my house, I mean, in my family, my mom, my dad, my brother, sister, everybody can cook but me. You wash the dishes. I hate doing the dishes. <laughs> and then what you do? Oh. I, I help with the cleaning, uh, I help with, uh, well, the cleaning is almost always. Uh, sometimes I do the laundry. I mean, that's not a problem for me, doing the laundry. And my clothing, I mean, in more than 20 years, my wife never irons my clothes. I don't like washing my clothes. I don't like to do the clean, the, the, the... The laundry, I don't like. Oh, no. 
No, in my case, the, the, the ironing, the ironing, just me. I don't like nobody doing that. Yeah. yeah nice. I, I, I learned uh, iron my clothes when I was uh, maybe 10 or 15 years old. When my mom, oh. when my mom left, left, left my house, I have, to, I have to learn that. I have to learn to cook. I have to learn to wash. I have to learn how to, how to. Home. I have to learn how to, how to I cook, have, how to write, how to wash. I have to wash. No, it's had, had in past tense. Yeah, yeah, I have to. Had to, I had to. Yeah, it's right. Thank you. I had to, I had to learn, learn, no, I have to learn. It's only learn. learn. Right? Yeah, I have, I to, have learn to learn how to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, have in to. my case, in my case, my mom was a seamstress. What is that? Costurera. Ah, seamstress. Yeah, my mom used to work like that. And, and sometimes, I mean, I grew up, I was, I am the oldest, so I grew up helping her. Mm -hmm. So I Preparing learned how to iron, how I can sew with my hands, I can sew with a machine. And you know, too, in a machine. Yeah, yeah. I got a machine right here. I really, I, I, on, I only, know, I just know with, uh, with my hand. With a uh, by hand, design. by no. hand, yeah. By yeah, no, hand. I know. I came with a well. I came with three different type of machines. Really? What? Yeah. What's what kind? Oh, uh, the 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 regular ones, uh, Plana and Rana. Really? Yeah. Wow! I, amazing. And that's funny, you know. I learned that, but I also learned with my dad uh, some other activities. Because I know, well, I studied electricity. I'm an electrician. And I'm also your a father, plumber. Your yes, father also, was an electrician, no? Yeah, among other things. I'm also a plumber. I know plumbing. Wow. I can I can install ceilings. You can install it? Yeah, I can install ceilings. I can also, oh, I can install floors. Like uh, ceramic. With ceramic. Yeah. I mean, I learned in my whole life, I have learned many, many different activities. It's part to be a human. Yeah, I mean, we got to learn every single day something new. Yeah, the Bible says everything that you have opportunity to learn, learn it. Yeah. It's, it's really important. And when yeah, you need the way. Yeah, when, when you need something to do in your home, you have to you have to know that. Yeah. The only bad problem is that there's there cannot be nothing here wrong because my wife is like, go fix that. Go fix that. You know, all day long. <laughs> you are busy all the time. Yeah. Hey Magdalena, welcome. Nice talking to you as usual. It's okay. Thank you. Veronica. Hello, Veronica. How are you? Good evening, teacher. A little hungry. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. Oh, really? Why? What time did you get home? Mm, at seven, seven, seven fifty. Oh, really? So you didn't have time to have dinner? Excuse me? You didn't have time to have dinner? Um, no tuvo tiempo de cenar. Where did Veronica go? Veronica, Veronica. She's gone. Hey, Ingrid, how are you? 
Hi, teacher. It's okay today. It's okay Very today. Nice. Okay, that's right nice. now. That's it's, nice. it's today, <laughs> it's, it's very okay. Yeah, but it's a Monday. Monday are not days for saying, ah, it's okay. It's a Monday. Mondays are like, ah, no, yes. Um, the traffic is no, it's very complicated. It all, all, all every, 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 every Monday, every, every Monday. Yeah, I know, I know. I mean. Yes, the traffic is um, crazy. Yes, I. Yo me tardé. I lost. I lost. It took me. It took me. It took me uh, one hours uh, from Santa Tecla to Mexico Gonzalez in the morning, and my car uh, turned off. How do you say de la nada? Mm. Off. Okay. Out of a sudden. Out, out of a sudden. And in, I, yo hice, I make more I traffic. Made? Oh, really? Yes. I turn off. I, I out of a sudden in in the strip. <laughs> you know, ah, it's crazy. I cry. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine. Yes. Um, but I I resolved the problem the car is very very nice. Okay, well good thing that you could solve it. Excuse good thing me? because I mean it's good that you could solve that problem because um, sometimes with cars it's complex. Yeah, but different people um, say in the street, uh, I don't know, say, fundió el carro yo. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I, uh, I don't believe it, this, this affirmation that the, the people. But it didn't overheat. No le entiendo eso último, but no sobrecalentó. It didn't overheat. Uh, no, only I took me off a sudden. I, 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 no sé cómo se dice. Metí mal la velocidad. Metí mal la oh, yes. ah, well, don't worry, that happens. No, but I think the, the problem is very big, but, uh, but only, only, only was the battery and uh, <laughs> yeah but don't worry don't worry i mean it's only not move enough. only move the the car uh uh a uh, one strip is is more is menos complicada is less complex less complex um i i get out the how do you say grua ahí llegó Tall. And go the throw. And and took you to the to the workshop. To the uh, garage. Yes. Yes. Yeah, but the, the battery. No. But yeah, but it's pudo ser peor. Yes. Yeah, it could have been worse. Oh what a phrase. Hold yes, on. I... I will text it for you. It could have been worse. It could have been worse. I could it, have been it, worse. It, 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 it could have been worse. Yeah, it could have been worse. Pudo haber sido peor. I could have been worse. Yes. It, Ingrid, I it, don't know you. It, yeah, you always say I. It, it, it. it it could have been worse. It. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course, of course. Good thing that it was just the battery. Ingrid, yeah, welcome yeah. to the class. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Nice having you here. Thank you. Veronica, where did you go? You left me talking in the air. 
my internet is bad today. Yeah, yeah, they say that it's raining somewhere. But it always affects. This weather is not good for connection, for internet connection. But good to have you back, Veronica. Repeat, please. It is good to have you back. Es bueno tenerla de vuelta. Oh, thank you. A ver si no me saca el uh, Let's hope not. Maylin, hello, Maylin. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. You? I'm just great, just great. What about you? How was the weekend? What did you do? Um, it was very good. I... What about... Yeah, yeah, tell me. I sleep every day. <laughs> All day? All day. <laughs> oh my gosh. How do you do that? For um, me, that's impossible. The, um, I only, uh, how do you say, cancel? Tired? <laughs> Yeah, but sleeping all day, ooh, for me, is like a big no-no. The, the worries is, oh, 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 ¿cómo, ¿cómo le diría? ¿Cómo el clima estaba? Ah, because the, ah, the weather was fresh. Well, the weather was fresh. So you took advantage of the weather. That's nice. Yes. <laughs> great, great. Excellent. So, I mean, for you, it was just resting, nothing else. Para usted fue descanso, right? Thank you. I don't understand. Um, good part. For you, it was resting. Para usted fue descanso. Ah, yes. <laughs> Mailing, welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Hey guys, let me get the attendance, please. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Barrios. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Mármol. Present. Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo. Present. Thank you. Estefani Lizeth Molina Rodríguez. Present. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Thank you, Stephanie. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. Present. Ivan Petrovich Guzmán Aquino. Present. Ivania Chamile Domínguez Hernández. Present. Ivet Lisset Figueroa de Calles. Present, teacher. Karen Beatriz Moratalla Segovia. Present. Carla Lizeth García Lemos. Present teacher. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present teacher. Maylin Janet Manzano Montoya. Present. Nelson Antonio Arrodas Rosales. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Verónica Arelia Echala Ramírez. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present teacher. Chemara Elizabeth Cisneros. Carlos Josué Chávez. Okay, guys, let's see who else is around. <laughs> Carla, hello, Carla. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening, how are you? Fine. How was your weekend, Carla? Mm, so, how was so, so, why so poor? Um, my grandmother. 
Eh, yeah. um, what, do, what do you say eh, enferma? Oh, okay. You can say it like this. Sick, sick. My grandma. My grandma got sick. My grandma got sick. Got, got sick. Got sick. Oh, so sorry to hear that. Yes. Um. Mm, I not visit uh, hasta Chalatenango. No la pude visitar hasta Chalatenango. I couldn't go visit her. I couldn't go visit her. Oh, so sorry to hear that. Let's hope she gets better. But I'm going for it. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> well, welcome to the class, Carla. Okay. Okay, guys. Let's see. Today's class is going to be mostly like a review. We are going to do a couple of exercises related to our review because today, if you remember, it's the day when after the class, I'm going to be creating the grade from the section one, section two, and midterm exam, okay? So I'm going to be passing it. So today we're going to make a review. And in the manual, we have a series of uh, exercises that we are going to perform, but we are also going to do some speaking activities. First, we're going to start with a reading, a reading exercise. And it's going to be very, very interesting. So let me get everything prepared for you. Remember, if you got your manual, uh, you can use it. You can use it. And we're going to be working in page number 27. Page number 27 from your manual. And the exercise is this. Okay, the instruction. Read the following article about giving instructions to staff. Check true or false for the items below. Here are the items, but we are going to make a small reading. Number one, don't assume they know what you mean. You know what they say. Okay, that assumption is the mother of all mistakes. Don't be the fool that assumes people know what you mean. With most people in your office or businesses will be intuitive and switch on, they are not mind readers. An imperative when delivering clear instruction is to not assume the recipient knows what you mean. And this can be for anything from industry acronyms to who to contact in different departments or organizations. It will only take you a few seconds more to explain the details. Number two, be clear and specific. Everyone loves a waffle. Dripping in maple syrup, please. But no one likes waffle in conversation, and especially not in an email or when it's, it is a set of instructions. Whilst you don't want to rumble on in your set of instructions, that will be a waste of your time. And to be honest, they switch off after a while. You do want to ensure that your instructions are clear, specific, and concise. Personally, I prefer not to butter it up and will rather get straight to the point on what needs to be action or delivered rather than making the instructions too flowery, which will only confuse. Give time frames. Do not confuse matters but not by not being specific with your time frames and deadlines. What you consider as soon might be very different from your colleagues. If you think soon is the next couple of hours, yet your staff who you have instructed consider it to be in a few days, then this communication is going to have serious implications in any business or project. Give examples. 
Whenever possible, make sure you give examples. They will, this will be especially beneficial if they are new to the role or if they, can, if they haven't carried out the task before. This will help to add clarity to your instructions and help form a clearer picture of what it is you mean and what. Okay, guys, don't assume they know what you mean. This is very important, okay? In paragraph number one, vocabulary. Vocabulary from here, guys? Oh, this word is missing one L. Is this word, actually. Okay, Questions about vocabulary, paragraph one? Assumption, teacher. Assumption. Asumir. Asumir. No. Assumption. Where? I'm sorry, teacher. Yeah. Donde tiene el mouse, en la parte de arriba, donde dice and, es, es with chill. Arriba, aquí. Yeah. Arriba, arriba, donde está, donde dice will be into en una dos will be en intuitive otra. intuitive una otra and is and switch on es es qué significa and switch on okay eh, conectados encendidos ah. okay I mean, van a estar en la misma frecuencia okay <clears throat> Acronic, okay. Acronics. Uh -oh. Aquí se, sería row one, uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Un row acrónimo. number finds. Yeah, un acrónimo. Acrónimo, acrónimo. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, in paragraph number two, be clear and specific. You know what it's a waffle, right? Sirut, bro, number yeah. one. Okay, maple syrup is the uh, la miel de maple. Ah, interesting. What is the meaning dripping? Dripping, goteando. Uh, dripping, okay. Mm. Thank you. Okay, there is a, 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 a word game here. Game for the palabras. Waffle, you know, is what you eat, right? Es esa cosita que comen, que le ponemos este en el map. But no one likes waffle in conversation. In a conversation on waffle, it's como un error. Okay? Wills is mientras que. Mientras que. Rumble on, rumble on is when you start speaking and speaking and never get to the point. That's to rumble on. Rumble on. No aterriza. Yeah. Another one? Another word? Row number five con are clear, specific, and concisions. What's the meaning? Conciso. 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 Yeah. And bother, what did it up? Okay, this is an expression. Uh, that's what you do with bread sometimes. But when we are talking about this phrase, estamos hablando de no. No ponerle muchos adornos. That's why it says, and we'll rather get straight to the point. Aquí esta palabra está de mal. Y en lugar de eso, es irte directo al punto. Go straight to the point. Straight the point. Number three, give time frames. Vocabulary, guys. 
frames. Time frames, eh, margen de tiempo. Just the word frames es el marco, como de una fotografía, but time frames es un, un marco de tiempo. Un margen, margen de tiempo. That's why it says, do not confuse matters by not being specific with your time frames and deadline. Y fechas límite. Okay. Okay, guys, now the activity, your activity is this. You need to tell me true or false according to this, to the reading. According to the article, it is fine to make assumptions. It is important to go straight to the point to be clear. People would get confused with the directions if we use too many words. To avoid misunderstandings, one should be, one should be very clear in time frames. It is fine if the employees make a mistake that later we can show a sample. Okay, so that's the activity. That's what you are going to do. Now, uh, I will divide you in groups. You will have four minutes to do this exercise. And I want you, well, no, I'll give you six minutes, I'm sorry. And I want you to also get the idea, the main idea of each section, okay? Working as groups, I need you to get the main idea of each section. And you're going, I'm going to ask you perhaps about number one or number two for you to explain to me what is the idea, okay? So let's see. Let's do something better. So it can be easier for you. As we have four situations, right? Okay, group number one, that is uh, Ivan, Karen, Oscar, Armando, and Veronica. You're going to explain to the class, number one, don't assume they know, they know what you mean. You're going to explain to us in a few words. Group number two, Antonio Rodas, Carlos Rivaldo, Magdalena Escalante, and Wilfredo, you got be clear and specific. Group number three, Ingrid, Ivania, Carla, and Malian. You got number three, give time frames. And group number four, Carlos Eduardo, Edwin Alberto, Stephanie Lisset, and Yvette Figueroa. You got number four, give examples. Remember, you are going to explain the paragraph I assigned to you, and you also need to do the true or false exercise, okay? You will have six minutes for this activity. That way it's going to be shorter and you will have more time to analyze. So groups are ready, please let's do it. Ajá. Teacher, eh, es así, sacar las palabras que no entendamos de no, 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 no. You are going to explain me the main idea, la idea principal. Ah, ok. And you are going to do the exercise at the end. Y van a hacer el ejercicio del true or false. Just of the paragraph assigned to you. Solo el párrafo que le he asignado. Eh, no los puede recordar, es el 3, sí. Let me see your well, group what? number. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just a second. Yeah, your group number three. Three. Okay. 
Okay. Están las demás acá. Sí, acá están. Aquí estoy. Ustedes dicen cómo hacemos la dinámica. Mm. No, pero está lo que dice. No, ella está no bien. era esto lo que le estaba enseñando, pues. ¿Cómo no? No. no, no, está bien, ella lo que está diciendo está bien, solo que Página el paso 27. uno. Por eso mm. pero el paso uno. No cuadraba nada. Eso. Ah, sí, es cierto. Claro. <risa> Se uh -huh. parecen. Sí, ajá, esa. Ah, ok. Ah, yeah, yeah, you got... Yo leí. We are going to explain ahí. just number one. We are going to explain just number one. Me van a explicar solo el uno, ¿ok? Ok. Ok. And the exercise at the end. Y el ejercicio al final de la página. Mm. En los margen de tiempo. Ok. Uh -huh. Don't confuse matters. Ajá. Uh -huh. If that is, is true. Eh, está bien, que está bien cometer errores. Al menos no el que nos tocó a nosotros. Dice que es, está bien con de ejemplos. That remember, remember that you also go, are going to explain to me number four. Acuérdese que también me van a explicar el punto cuatro. Give examples. Okay, teacher. In English. Yep. Okay. <laughs> y especially beneficial they are. Make a mistake later. Later. I'm sorry, guys. Remember that you are also going to explain to me the point assigned to you. Okay. okay. Uh, Be clear and specific. You need to give me the main idea. Explain okay. in your own words. Okay. Continue. Thank you. Sorry to interrupt. <laughs> okay. El, el párrafo 2 es el nuestro. Uh, may, the time, the paragraph two. Be clear and specific. Who understands the main idea? Okay. In in my case, I can tell them is uh, to be. Oh. Okay. Um, dice dijo el que vamos a explicarle el párrafo y vamos a contestar la pregunta. En ah, okay. el, ajá, en el caso de nosotros las la... preguntas, las preguntas. Oh. All oh. the questions oh. at the end. Five questions. Eh. Yeah, all the questions at the end. Okay. You're going to tell me if they are true or false and explain to me the paragraph. Oh my goodness. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> el paragraph is four. Okay. Y vamos, o sea, vamos a ejemplificarle el párrafo 4, pero vamos a contestar todas las preguntas. Yep. Ok. Bye. Ok. Entonces. Quiero ver qué dice el primero. Or if they haven't carried out the talk before. It will help to have clarity to use structural health from a bigger picture. <clears throat> Como va, Nina? <laughs> Aquí estoy. Y por eso, according to the article, it is fine to make something. Mm. I, creo, I think no, because say, eh, wherever possible, make sure you give samples. O sea, es, es mejor dar ejemplos que asumir las cosas, ¿no? Es correcto. I think no. According to the article, they say it is fine to make assumptions. O sea, es correcto que su más, pero al principio dice give examples. Que, que es posible mejor que esté seguro de dar ejemplos. Entonces, si das ejemplos, no asumís las cosas. I think, I don't know. It's correct, Ajá. my opinion. Uh, you think about Ajá. it. 
What, ¿Tú qué dices, Sibet? What do you think about it? Mm, pues yo entiendo que el primer párrafo le dice como que asumir no es lo mejor, ¿verdad? Ya. Yeah. Entonces, yeah. en ese sentido, la primera pregunta sería falsa. Ya, yeah, correcto. I got it. Ajá. Ajá. Vaya, entonces. Pero no, Stephanie, en Edwin. Eh, yo opino lo mismo. Porque... Ok, entonces pongámosle falso. Digo, pasame un lapicero, porfa, hijo. Hijo, un lápiz. Ajá. Veamos. Ahí. Dice, it is important to go straight to the point to be clear. Hmm. Be clear and Siempre. Dice this ser claros y específicos, dice yeah. el título del párrafo. ¿no? Uh -huh. Y la pregunta nos dice, veamos. Es importante. Ir tú... directo al grano para ser claros. Ajá. Yeah, es verdadera. Es, es verdadero. Es true. Uh -huh. es true. True. Yes. True. I think it's true. True. Because true. the paragraph will be clear and specific. Everyone knows a waffle. Yeah, some samples. Yeah. Oh, Persona C. Se... Se confundirá o se confundió. ¿Cómo así yeah. se confundirá? People con las confused. indicaciones. Ajá. Uh -huh. Si sí, nosotros many usamos words. muchos. Many muchas words. palabras. Ya. Yeah. Maybe. Eh, Do not confuse Mares. Don't be specific with your time frame. Creo que sería. True. True. O sea que tenemos que leer los cuatro párrafos. Sí. Tenemos que leer los cuatro para contestar las preguntas, yeah, pero no, vamos a explicarles. Yo no estoy leyendo a la carrera, todavía no. <risa> Espérate. Vamos a ver. Ustedes ya los leyeron, ¿Ah, pues contesten ustedes en lo que yo leo. Please. You, this time frame. Veamos, get time frames. This, dar time margen frames. de tiempo. Uh, dar margen de tiempo, dijo. O sea, a la primera. Okay, your classmates are working in the breakout rooms, but I'm almost recalling them back. Pero acá se los traigo de regreso, okay? okay. So, don't worry about it. Ya, Carlos, no problema. Let's bring everybody back. I'm gonna send you, I'm going to assign you a group, Xiomara, because of the activity. No, but later, later. I'll recall everybody back better.
Okay, guys. Group number one, Ivan, Karen, Oscar, Veronica. Tell me, don't assume they know what you mean. Explain to me, please. Karen, you call. Okay, Karen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. The first point, don't assume they know what you mean. We discussed that it is an advice that we should not assume that other people know things at first. We shall not make assumptions. Um, to give instruction, we must know that we all understand things differently, explain clearly to other people, and this applies to all aspects and types of communication to avoid misunderstanding. Quite interesting, thank you. Great. Number two, Antonio, Carlos Celibaldo, Magdaleno, Wilfredo, you got guys a bit clear and specific, please. Okay, teacher. In our opinion, when give a direction, we should be, we should to be specific and consist because people who receive the instructions uh, can be confused with my instructions. Okay, perfect. That, we should be, we should be. Cuando tengo el should, okay, es un modal, después de él nunca voy a poner el to, never, ok? Don't forget that. After should, as, after will, never are you going to write to, even if it's the verb be, should be, ok? Thank you. Well done, guys. Let's Thank see. You. Group number three, Ingrid, Ivania, Carla, and Maylene. Give time frames. Who's gonna to explain to me? Um, the first that I read the, the paragraph, yes. All no, explain. what I need is just to explain, just to explain. Okay, I mm -hmm. help me the other co, co uh, uh, the, uh, the other girl. Classmates? Aha, uh -huh, classmate. Um, the paragraph, um, I, the main idea is the different process in the business. Um, um, and the other idea, uh, the, the different hours, uh, how do you say tardar or cuánto se tarda? Takes. Takes. Eight. Takes. Takes. Takes takes the takes the customer and the employees for the finally this this process for the the buy the different product or for the or the the sell the product to sell to sell the product okay interesting to sell the product thank you Group number four, Carlos, Edwin, Stephanie, Yvette, Rosalina, you got give examples. Who's gonna explain to me? Can you explain? Okay. Okay. Uh, tell uh, about about giving example to help make uh, the instruction uh, uh, clara, uh, cleaner. Clear, clear. If they uh, are new uh, to the whole and comprenda como. Understand. Understand uh, what you mean. Okay, perfect, thank you. Very well done, guys. 
Now, sentence number one was, according to the article, it is fine to make assumption. Tell me, Maylin, that's true or false? According to the article, it is fine to make assumptions. Mainly. Okay, let's see. Carlos Elivaldo. What you got for number one? According to the article, it is fine to make assumptions. Is it true or false? False. Perfect, mister. Thank you very much. Number two. It is important to go straight to the point to be clear. Let's see. Ivan, true or false? True. Thank you, mister. That's true. Number three, people will get confused with the directions if we use too many words. Stephanie, true or false? Okay, let's see, Ingrid, what you got for this one? The number three is true. Okay, thank you, well done. Number four, to avoid misunderstandings, one should be very clear in time frames. What do you think about it, Carla? True or false? True. Okay, yeah, you're right, that's true. Number five, number five. It is fine if the employees make a mistake. Later, we can show examples. Let's see, what do you think about it, Wilfredo? True or false? Wilfredo? It's, it's true, teacher. Oh. Here it says, later we can show examples. Actually, Wilfredo, it's better if we give the examples before. So in this case, it is false. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Well done. Okay, now. Exercise number one, page number 28 from your manual. Fill in the blanks using there is and there are. And exercise number two, unscramble the words to create sentences. These two exercises, you are going to work them in groups, but the groups are going to be smaller. Okay? Those exercises are going to resolve in groups, but in the smaller groups. So I'm going to divide you right now. I'm going to recreate the groups. Okay, groups are created. Let me just check something. Okay. okay. You will have five minutes for both activities.
let's see are, are there any I, computers are, able are there are there, are yeah. there? Are there? Is there? Okay. Is there, verdad? Three, three. Are there, yeah, porque es computers. No person. Ajá, uh -huh. la tres es is computer. there porque is es there. no personal. Is ah, uh, is a one. Is talking about a no personal at your company. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is there? Okay. Conference rooms is are plural. there? Are there? Yeah. Are there? Okay. Number five. Is there. Light is there. in your workplace. Is there, right? Is there. Mm -hmm. Mucha luz. Uh -huh. Are there. Are there oh, many there. things to do every day? Are there. And the last one. Nice. Are there mm -hmm. no good places to have a break? Are there. Mm -hmm. Finish. Then the other one. Okay. Unscramble the words to create, to create, mm -hmm. to create sentences. Mm -hmm. Informer allowed, allowed. ¿Cómo que se pronuncia esa? Allowed. 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 Uh -huh. Our clothes. To wear not you. Okay. O sea. Informer clothes. You are not allowed. No puedes usar ropa informal, ¿verdad? Ay. You are not allowed. Uh -huh. You are not. not informal clothes, I think. I don't know. What do you think about No, 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 no. Informal clothes. No, you are not allowed to wear informal yeah. clothes. You yes, are not. Yes. You are not allowed. Uh -huh. Not to use allowed. To wear. Yeah. Informal clothes. To wear. To wear informal clothes. You are not. You are not mm -hmm. allowed. Uh -huh. You are not. Allowed. Allowed. To, but See, to wear. Clothes. To. Okay. To In wear informal. Yeah. Oh, clothes. Informal <laughs> clothes. Informal clothes. Cloth. Cloth. Ok. ¿Ya la copiaste? Yes. Sí, sí. Ok, bueno. Yes. Smoke, no employees. Two no? employees, maybe. Two employees. Are not. No, employees sería. Employees. Ajá. Employees. Are not. Are not. Smoke. Ajá. No. Es, es. Employees are not allowed. To, to smoke. To smoke. Yes. Mm -hmm. But not. But not. Employees. No, I went to. To smoke. Smoke. Number three. Number three. Three. Um, it's is. Smoke. Okay. It's not. <sighs> It is not allowed, 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 allowed mm -hmm. to, to bring. It is, no, pero ahí es. Eh, it children. Is children. 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 Ah, no puedes not... traer los niños, pero.
Hello, teacher. Hello, Carlos. Welcome. Voy saliendo, de, voy saliendo del trabajo ahorita, oye. Ok, Estoy no problem, no problem. Okay, guys, let's see. Let's see, let's see. We've got a song to exercises. Okay, fill in the blanks using there is and there are. That's the first exercise. Okay, let me just get everything ready. Antonio Rodas, number one, tell me, is there or are there? Is there. Okay. Is there, perfect. Number two, uh, Carlos Alivaldo. Is there or are there? Are there, teacher. Perfect. Are there. Number three, Elwin Alberto. Is there, are there? Permítame que entró, no tenía problema con entró. Okay, eh, sería... Are there? Okay. In the case of number three, mister, is there enough personal? Personal refers to a group. La palabra personal oh. se refiere a un grupo. Okay. It's uncountable. It's incontable. So we assume it's singular. Okay. okay. Now let's see. Uh, Stephanie Lisette, number four. Is there or are there? Okay, Ingrid. Number four. Um, are there? Okay, number four, perfect. Are there? Number five. Ivania. Tell me, Ivania, number five. Is there? Perfect. Number six, Yvette. Hey, uh, are there, teacher? Number six are there. And number seven, uh, Yvette Figueroa. Are there the new teacher? Excellent. 
are there. Okay, and the sentences go like, is there any paper in the printer? Are there any computers available? Number three, is there enough personnel at your company? Number four, are there many conference rooms in your workplace? Number five, is there much light in your workplace? Number six, are there many things to do every day? Number seven, are there good places to have a break? Well done, guys. Excellent. Questions? No, perfect. No questions. Okay, the next exercise was for you to unscramble the words to create sentences. Okay, let's see. Carla Lisette, number one, sentence number one. Ahorita la acabo de terminar. <laughs> Pero no sé si está buena. Okay, let's try, let's try. You close not are allowed to girls informal. Okay, look, you are not allowed to wear Ah. To wear informal clothes. Okay, thank you. Number two, let's see. Number two goes to. <laughs> Karen Beatriz. Okay. Employees are not allowed to smoke. Perfect. Employees, employees are not allowed to smoke. Employees, remember the pronunciation, employees. Okay, Veronica, what you got for number three, Veronica? Children are not allowed to bring it. Mm. Okay, look at this. It is not allowed to bring. Oops. Is not allowed to bring children. Number four. And uh, Xiomara. Um, we are not allowed. Uh -huh. We are not allowed to, to extend lunch time, to extend our lunch time. To extend our lunch time. Lunch time. Okay. Lunch time. Mm -hmm. We are not allowed to extend our lunch time. Perfect. And <laughs> Wilfredo, number five. People. Uh -huh, people. Check. Mm -hmm, look. Are, are not, not allowed allow to to check in to check in late. late. Perfect. So the sentence is number one. Thank you very much, Wilfred. You are not allowed to wear informal clothes. 
employees are not allowed to smoke. It is not allowed to bring children. We are not allowed to extend our lunchtime. People are not allowed to check in late. Okay, guys. And let me just share with you the answers of this exercise. Okay. Now, 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 very good exercise. But right now we are going to work a little bit different, okay? We're going to have a little bit of conversations. Okay. Okay, guys, now. Um, we're going to talk about goals, okay? Things that we are focused on getting. You're going, I'm gonna give you four questions. The questions are like, are these ones. What is your biggest goal in life? How do you plan to achieve that goal? What are your short-term goals? What are your long-term goals? Okay. So I'm going to send you back to the groups. You will have six minutes to ask and answer those questions. Okay. Then when we come back, I'm going to pick six persons from you, all of you, to ask and you're going to give me your answers to different questions, okay? I mean, one of those four questions. So I'm gonna send the questions also to the WhatsApp. You can also have it there. And I'm gonna send you to the groups. Did I get the second attendance, guys? No, not Okay, too. I am so sorry. Let's get it now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my apologies. Carlos Eduardo Ortega Barrios. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmol. Present teacher. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Present teacher. Stephanie Lisset Molina Rodriguez. Gabriel Beltran Pérez. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. In here, teacher. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Presence. Ivania Chamile Dominguez Hernández. Present, teacher. Yvette Lisset Figueroa de Calles. Present. Karen Beatriz Moratalla Segovia. Present. Carla Lisset García Lemus. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present. Maylin Janet Manzano Montoya. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present, teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present, teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Present, teacher. Verónica Arelí Ayala Ramírez. Present. Wilfredo Areval Ortiz. Present, teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Carlos Josué Chávez. Present, teacher. Okay, guys. Six minutes. Hurry up.
Mm, bueno, está... Sí, correcto. Sí, está okay. la... Ok, entonces. Ok. Si quiere, pregúntame. Permítame. Ups. Permítame que ahorita. Ok. No te pregunto. Bueno, número uno, ese what is, what is your biggest, biggest, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Biggest. Biggest, ok. What is your biggest goal in life? Combine my work life with my uh, family life it's correct combine teacher work life combine yeah, yes yeah you can say combine okay me, me digo combine my work mm -hmm. pues carlo uh-huh and y pedir que, que lo cocinen. And ask for it to be cooked. Ok, and ask to... What? For and it... Ask... For it to be What's cooked. Up? It's fresh fish. fish. Fresh fish. Uh, yeah, yeah it's, it's fresh fish. Uh -huh. And then... Yeah, uh, Maybe take a swimming pool. Ajá, uh -huh, after you're waiting for the cook the food. Yes, yes. Okay. It's like it's like a restaurant when you can uh -huh. when you can arrive and uh -huh. and say eh, this fish is like for me or <laughs> this fish like to me. <laughs> I don't yeah. know what is that. You're looking for the fish in the, uh, in the for pool. example in the pool uh, yeah and then uh, and the and the fish is, and the fish in too. tank. Uh -huh. And the fish is tank, yeah. And you yeah. take one and go and, to the kitchen and cook. And I want to cook yeah. your fish yeah. and you can yeah. eat with, with all, your, nice. all your family. Yeah, it's nice. And, and, and also, um, bueno, that is my uh, start. Number one, Eduardo. What is your biggest goal in life? Okay, my opinion, learning in the English language, the world. Aprender bien este idioma de inglés. Learn English. Ok. Eh, how do you plan to achieve that goal? Study hard. Study hard. Yes. Eh, number three. What are your short and goal? Uh, get a better job. Repeat, please. Get a better job. Oh, o sea, okay. conseguir un mejor okay. trabajo. Mm -hmm. Okay. What are your long term goals? Yes. Number the last four. one. Um, what are your long-term goals? Can and provide and the propose propose more and the goal in my life. Repeat more slow, please, Eduardo. It improvise.
Okay, let's bring everybody back in 60 seconds. Let's see, we're just waiting for your classmates to come back. Okay, let's see, let's see. Maylin, tell me, what is your biggest goal in life? Teacher, sorry, I'm going to go to my house. Okay, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Magdaleno. Okay, teacher. Okay, Magdaleno. Magdaleno, <laughs> I want you to pick one of your classmates and ask. Okay. Choose. Okay. Um, maybe Ingrid. Okay. okay. Um, which one? Up to you, my friend. Okay. Ingrid, what, what is your biggest goal in life? Ingrid. Hello, teacher. My Magdaleno teacher. just asked you. Excuse me, Magdaleno, please, please. The first question. Yeah. What is your biggest goal in life? I... Maybe I, I buy a house <laughs> and learning English. <laughs> okay, the ah. second question, please, Magdaleno. How do you plan to... Uh, the pronunciation is a gift, teacher? Achieve, achieve. 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 How do you plan to achieve that goal? Uh, the first, work very hard. And the second, and study very hard. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Magdalena. Yeah. Ingrid, your turn. Pick one of your classmates and ask. Whatever. The first two questions. Ah, okay, the first pen can only work. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, pick my teacher. No lo encuentro. In the Zoom chat, in the chat, the Zoom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo se me había perdido. I lost the chat. The okay. next question or the. No, third? the first two. Ah, uh, the first two. Um, what are, no, what is your biggest goal in life? Um, um, Veronica. And Veronica is like, <laughs> sorry. My biggest goal is to be happy, not gory, and how um, get life. Okay. The next question How do you plan to up to? I ship that go out. Um, work hard and always remember those goals. Okay. 
Okay, perfect. Thank you. Veronica, pick one of your classmates. Um... Karen, uh, what is your biggest goal in life? My biggest goal in life is combine my work life with my family life. Okay. How do you plan to achieve that goal? Being organized with my time. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you, Veronica. Appreciate it. Okay, Karen, you're the last one. Pick one of your classmates. Ivan. Okay, Ivan. What is your biggest goal Actually. in life? Okay, interesting questions, my friends. I I read a uh, wisdom man, wisdom man, and peace in life. How do you plan to achieve that goal? Okay, simple. As God, how do you do it? Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, all of you guys. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, now next set of questions. Now we are going to talk about friendship. And the question are, what is a best friend? What is the longest friendship that you have had? What makes friends different from family? And what qualities do you think are important in a friend? Okay. Again, I'm going to send you to the groups. You're going to have six minutes and then I'm going to recall you back. So, hurry up. Ah, Ahí está en el, en el, en el what WhatsApp. Is a best friend. What is the long experience? ¿Cuál, cuál, cuál, es, ¿Cuál es tu mejor amigo? Uh -huh. The first one is, la... what is a best friend? La... ¿Qué es un mejor amigo? ¿Qué es ser un mejor ah. amigo? <laughs> Qué filósofo nos ha puesto, teacher. Yeah, yeah. Now, <laughs> I'm going to explain to you why. Le voy a explicar por qué. These okay. questions are for you to think, right? Lo ponen a uno pensar. <laughs> that way, in that process of thinking, you will try to find the best way to express your ideas in English. Al tratar de buscar la mejor manera de explicar su idea en inglés, okay. usted va a estar pensando, por el momento va a estar pensando en los idiomas, pero la idea es que este tipo de ejercicios lo lleven a pensar en inglés directamente. That's the idea. That's why the, the questions must be simple to understand, but you need to think how to answer. Son preguntas fáciles de entender, pero a la hora de responder, usted tiene que think. That's the goal. Esa es la meta. Great idea, my friends. Hello, guys. Hello. What is a best friend? ¿Qué es eso de ser un buen amigo? A best friend, mejor amigo. What is a how best do you, How do you write? ¿Quién te apoya? Oh, who supports you? Supports, oh, okay. Supports, double P, remember, double P. Okay.
familia. Oh, sí. Got you, got you thinking, guys. Got yeah, you think thinking, about right? It. Yes. Yeah. That's if we're talking about, if we're talking it's about, uh, think. she has friends uh, for kinder. For oh, kinder. Really? Yeah. From, yes. from, from kinder? Kinder? Yeah. Okay. No, no, from kinder, from children's garden. For children's school. Uh huh. Ah, okay. <laughs> children. Incredible. Uh... <laughs> for me, high school, but yeah, wow, that's it's, preschool, preschool, yeah, right? <laughs> yes, from kindergarten. Yeah. You see, kindergarten. Oh my goodness, no, <laughs> I don't remember any. <laughs> no, me neither. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, back in my memory, I mean, I remember perhaps a couple of situations. Ah, situation, yeah. <laughs> but no, no, uh -huh. from kinder, to be honest with you, no, because I just took one level of kinder. Yo solamente hice un grado de kinder. Está temblando. Was... Uh, yes. Creo... Yes. Her shake. Yeah. Excuse me, es que acaba de temblar feo. <laughs> sí, sí, yo acabo sí, de sentir feo. Sí, sí. Air... Oh. Earthquake. 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 Yeah, Earthquake. Excuse me. It's English class. Okay, you're <laughs> I, I didn't even feel it. Really? Really. Where are really? you? Where are you? San Martin? I'm in El oh, Pango. Uh, Santa Tecla. <laughs> yeah, even, but my chair, my chair moves. Uh, usually. Every, every time. <laughs> then. Yeah, my chair moves. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Okay, but okay. the next one, what makes friends different from family? Mm, yeah. ¿Qué hace diferente a los amigos de la familia? Mm -hmm. mm, number. I think, well, for me, I, ¿cómo se dice escoger? Choose. I choose. Huh? I choose what? my friends. My family is my family. <laughs> I select maybe. Yeah. yeah. You can say I pick. I pick? Yeah. Oh I yeah. Pick my friends. I pick my friends, but my family, no, my family come to me. Yeah, it's given. <laughs> is my you got like anyway. <laughs> anyway, yes. <laughs> what qualities? Ah, we're talking about you, Yvette and Magdaleno. Um, sería algo así como. Um, Pero en inglés.
leal. Bueno, pues nos vamos, muchachos. True and loyal. True and loyal. Where are you going? Yo pensé que no íbamos. Ajá. <ríe> Sorry, teacher, pensé que no, pensé que no estaba sacando. Ajá. As soon as I appear, tan pronto como aparezco. No, teacher, I think the, the get out the, the big salar, the big, no sé cómo se sale. Room. The big room. <laughs> Sorry. Shame on you. Shame on you. Let's no, go back. Teacher. Let's go back. Teacher. Yeah. ¿Cómo se dice tener más confianza? To be trustful. To be to... trustful. Okay. Yeah. Teacher, how do you say maldades? Que te descubren maldades. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Eh, como cuando dicen. Eh, se cubren oh, maldades. Se cubre de back. Ok. To cover your back. To pero, cover. Eh, oh, pero Después me lo escribe, es... teacher. Yeah, to yeah, cover. I Okay, somebody was asking me for this phrase. Alguien me preguntó por ahí por esta frase. Cover up pranks es como cubrir una travesura. Cover up bad deals eh, es como decir cubrir una, algo malo que uno ha hecho. Okay, let's see, let's see. Who am I going to ask? Mr. Chavez, tell me. Hello, teacher. On your opinion, what is what is it to be a best friend? A uh, best friend is a, a good friend, is a sincere and show, show it in difficult times for me. Okay, perfect, thank you. What is the longest friendship that you have had? Uh, the longest friendship uh, I have had is with a person meet at a school. Okay, wow. Excellent. Thank you. Xiomara. Okay, teacher. Yes, teacher. In your opinion, what makes friends different from family? I think the difference may be a friend lead me, but my family, no. Okay, perfect, thank you. Wilfredo, what is a best friend? Uh, a best friend, I never leaves, I never leaves you. Okay, tell me, what is the longest friendship that you have had? What is the longest friendship that you have had? The second question. I still keep your friendship. Aún conservo su amistad. All right. Uh, yes. Oh, that's good. That's good. Excellent. Thank you. Oscar. Yeah, teacher. What makes friends different from family? Uh, different uh, respect uh, my family, the, the friend and uh, family. 
Okay, um, perfect. Excellent. Now let's see, Carlos Elivaldo. What qualities do you think are important in a friend? Uh, important is confidence. Confident. Oh, okay. Excellent. That's okay. good. Mailing. In your opinion, yeah. what is it? What is a best friend? Uh, <laughs> the person who who support you in uh, in good and bad moments. Mm. Okay. Thank you. Interesting. Magdaleno, what makes friends different from family? Um, maybe um, we can pick our friends. And you say that you said that <laughs> our family is done. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Let's see. Um, who's going to be? Ivania. Okay, perhaps Ivania is not available. Ingrid. Hello, teacher. What is the question? Okay, what qualities do you think are important in a friend? Um, lo loyal. Yeah. And confident. Um, Perfect. Uh, um, trust trusty. Trustful or trusty? Confiable. Trusty. Uh huh. Okay, um, okay, that's fine. Excellent. Hey, guys, very well done. Let me just explain something. Uh, perdón, quiero explicarles algo. Uh, something that you must be aware of is the, the goal uh, implicit in this type of exercises. If you know it, the questions are simple. Simple to understand, but the answers, as I was explaining to some of the groups, are a little bit more complex. And that's the idea, because as you understand the question in English, your brain starts processing the vocabulary that you know in order to create a, and to coordinate those words into a clear idea that you can transmit to people. So what you are doing in that moment is thinking in English. And that's the objective of this activity. That's why all along the course, we are going to be doing activity, activities similar to this. Now, I need to tell you about your final homework. This is an extra homework. For the last two days of classes, para los últimos, well, actually for the last three days of classes, I'm going to set apart 15 minutes. Voy a apartar 15 minutos. Uh, you will have two minutes, all of you, tell us that it, will have two minutes to prepare a small, a short presentation. Van a preparar una presentación. Any topic, up to you, okay? Whatever you want to talk about in English. Minimum two minutes, max three minutes, okay? So, I want you to start thinking about which topic you are going to present. Yes, Ingrid? Uh, for tomorrow. No, for the final three classes. Okay. Para las últimas tres clases, usted me prepara una presentación de dos a tres minutos sobre cualquier tema que usted quiera exponer en inglés. Okay? Before those days, if you want to share info with me, antes de la fecha, si quieren compartir información, 
If you want me to check something, can you register algo? If you want me to help with the pronunciation of something, no problem. Send it to me in private and I will help you. Okay? Teacher, no problem. This level, viene yo con gusto. Yes? Es, es, this level finally 25. Or other day. No. We finished the 20. Sorry. Okay. El 29 terminó. Okay, teacher. I confused. I got confused. I got confused. Do you understand the final activity? Entienden la actividad final? It's very simple. Yeah. And remember, it's yeah, any sure. topic, whatever you want. Lo que sea que se le se le antoje. Okay. Teacher, I have a question. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Um, in the end of each class, you you choose someone. Pick. You pick someone uh, of us. Oh, we have um, a I, specific day. No, I am picking. Before it used to be that they assigned me the days. So they said that I'm assigning not the person. But right now I am picking. And if somebody cannot, uh, sometimes I have the time and I ask somebody else too. Okay. You haven't had Magdalena? No lo tengo en la lista. I don't know. No, you are not yet. You are for next week. It's okay. Okay. Hey guys. Thank you very much. Let me get the final attendance before we leave. Oh my gosh. Carlos Eduardo Artiga Barrios. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmol. Present teacher. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Present teacher. Stefan Elisset Molina Rodriguez. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. Present. Ivan Petrovich Guzmán Aquino. I'm here. Ivania Chamile Domínguez Hernández. Present teacher. Ivet Lizette Figueroa de Calles. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Moratalla Segovia. Present. Carla Lizette García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present. Maylin Janet Manzano Montoya. Present. Nelson Antonio Arrodas Corsales. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Present teacher. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Verónica Arelía Echala Ramírez. Present. Wilfredo Areva Ortiz. Present teacher. Chemar Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Present. Carlos Josué Chávez. Present teacher, good night. Okay, guys, it was a pleasure. I hope you have a good night. See you tomorrow. If you have not finished the platform, remember to finish it tonight. Okay? The Bye, second... teacher. Bye, Bye teacher. Bye, tomorrow. Sorry, teacher. <laughs> Bye, see you tomorrow. Bye, see ya. Sorry, no teacher. problem, no problem. <laughs> I know. Bye. <laughs> Ahí le estoy no, escribiendo no. que tengo dudas, oye. Ok, if you want, you can stay here. Ok. But, uh, But course... let me just wait a second, ok? Vamos a yes. esperar un minuto. Good night, teacher. Have a good night, Wilfredo. Okay, tell me which is the, okay, no, first let me get the, the, the platform ready. Okay. In which section are you? In the section está? Estoy en, ahorita le digo en cuál teacher. Ahí estoy. Sí. 
Fíjense que me da error la donde ponemos are and is. Ahorita le Yeah, my dear, but I need the number of the exercise. Yes. Why? Permítame un momento que no lo encuentro. No problem, no problem. Ahorita lo tengo. Aquí hoy no lo voy a encontrar y en la clase vamos a estar hablando. Vamos a ver. Ay, chicha, no lo encuentro. Si quiere le escribo mejor y lo busco tranquila porque no lo encuentro. Aquí. Me acuerdo que usted estaba en final exam. Sí. Right. Yes, teacher. Okay, let me see. I can log in. Final exam. Aquí estoy. Part one, two, three, or four. The last two. Ahorita voy a comerme. Si quiere, teacher, le escribo y le mando exactamente mis dudas porque no las encuentro ahorita. Todas me salen menos la que ando buscando. Take your time. Yo tengo okay. tiempo, don't worry. Ok. Aquí está. Ok, es la parte uno del examen. Ajá. Las últimas okay. dos preguntas. Which exam? ¿Cuál exam? Eh, um, se lo comparto porque no sé. Final exam? Final exam, exacto. Ok, let me get to the final exam. Part number one. Mm -hmm. Part number one. Sí, the number, number four and number five. Ahí, ahí. Ok. You say... Jen, you... not unclog the cords. Yeah. Y me sale mal, se la voy a enseñar. Jen, not unplug the cord. Ah. You see? Yeah, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank you. No problem, no problem. Whenever you got any doubt, please ask me, okay? Okay, teacher. Um, yes, okay. <laughs> My dear, have a good night. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. See ya. Take care. Take care.